Bro, what? How, man? Uh, how? How does that even make sense? I think we have enough scrap to research this garage door, so I guess we do that. 75 only. Cheap at twice the price. We're going back to the island. I want to see if we can get into that decay before anybody else. Yeah, this used to be a hole. <laughs> Oh, bro, this is taking forever. I could probably use this to heal right quick. Ooh, yeah, I'm gonna use this to comfort heal right quick. Sometimes the best thing to do when you're feeling down is to just, you know, sit back, take a load off, recover your health a little bit that way, and uh, get back to it with fresh eyes. Come on, man, no teas? No tea for me. We could do the freaky deaky thing and try to go inside. Run the risk of losing an MP5. It's not terrible, but not ideal either. I don't particularly want to do that without guaranteed exit. This is, yeah, okay, so they're out of those, which is good. This thing is decaying too. There's a way up there, dude, there is. I didn't bring any wood with me, which was a critical mistake. Alright, let's find some more driftwood. Finish building in. That might be enough to get to the roof. If we can get to the roof, I think we've got a good shot. Tough one. Nope. Ah. Well, not entirely a waste of time, definitely sort of a waste of time. So this place is probably just on ice at this point until this floor breaks, which I think is what anyone who's here is waiting on. Having at least a thousand wood on you when you're naked and jumping into compounds is key because getting into the compound is only half the battle, but getting out of it is going to be the other half. And if you don't have enough wood to make the jump back out, then you are stuck with any loot that you've earned. 73! Oh, maybe I try to bait the patrol heli. I don't think it'll do any damage to the space while I'm in it, but it might. It's worth a shot. Somebody's fighting him. 
Oh my god. Damn, bro. Okay. Never mind. Hmm. This wasn't exactly how I wanted to go about getting rid of this. Okay. Hmm. We're gonna go up here, we're gonna take a look at this thing. Pretty sure this one was decaying earlier and we were interested in it, but we never came back, so let's double check. Empty. It's not promising, so we'll go back up to this one. Maybe look back down if we need to. The building plan. This one I know was decaying, but I think all the metal on it was still intact at the time. Ooh. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Grab me those. Those. And one of these. That's a lot of bones, brother. That's a lot of bones. That makes me uneasy, brother. Um, should we do that? Free base. up here see what's going on up top whoa 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 where the hell are you going all right i really want this but i do not have enough wood for it so let's go do some chopping Oh, interesting. Oh, that's a shotgun trap. Nice. I'm glad that thing didn't kill me. Glad I totally remember that it was there. Didn't forget. Okay. So... Reading this, you rated me. I hope you enjoy my DB and revolver. At least I got garage door researched. Have a good day. I'm glad you did too, buddy. Take that. I don't really know why Bro decided to leave all of his shit open. I think I'm good to leave everything else here for somebody else. I don't feel like I need any more of this loot, personally. I do want this horse, though, so I will be taking him to the gas station to recycle. Let's get these free beds right quick. Trick with campers, one thing to keep in mind is that you can, even if they're decayed like this, you can still jump in and set them as your spawn point, as long as they're unlocked. I always check the overhead as well. If you hit X, you can swap the seats. You can actually make up to four beds in these. You just have to keep swapping seats. Double check both sides. I don't know if both sides share the same, like, locker or not, but I check both sides anyway, just to be sure. Alright, let's get some ladders made, go back to that big decay, finish it up, and get the hell out of here. These gears are going to be nice too, though. We can get some garage doors down. Actually fortify this thing. It might even be worth just keeping it if we can.
seen any flippers. But maybe we take this instead. Okay, so we died with our flippers, which is kind of an L, but that's okay. Maybe I just wait here. Wait here for it to decay. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure there's somebody here. They might know that I'm here. That might be why they're lurking. If they looked down, they would have seen those two rocks there, and they might have thought, oh, perhaps somebody else is hiding down here. But... I don't know. It's a little bit of comfort where I am. I think it's because I'm close to the furnaces, but as the comfort goes higher, at least I'll know that somebody is nearby. Okay, that's interesting. C4 rocket. I might have seen me for a split second. Alright, I think we should be safe from here. Ooh, Scrappy's coming back. I made probably the best timing right there. This base is such an anomaly. doors going. Let's do three and then we can maybe convert one of those outer walls into a vending machine maybe. do it. It's not the kind of man that I am. I let the poor Solo build on his own. I'm thinking the reason that there were so many nodes up here earlier is because nobody's been here for months. Alright, let's just knock these two out. That'll help increase the spawn rate. If you thin out some of the nodes in the area, it'll encourage them to respawn a little bit faster. So, try to take out any nodes that you can when you're farming, even if you don't particularly need them in this trip. I think we're going to have a really hard time finding any more stone than this. Once we get this backup base fully locked up, I might F1 kill and respawn on that island and just see if there's any loot left. Because I'm pretty sure they just chain raided all those. Go get more metal. This is gonna take forever to farm any sort of stone out here, so we just metal this shit.
We're going to make this base a little bit tricky. We're going to put a floor here. Drop down in here to get TC. Bending machine there. Electric furnace is below. Like that. Yeah, I think that'll work. We do something like... Okay. That's kind of cool. So we begin the process of transferring everything from one to the other. Okay, that was a full metal AK guy. Where'd he go? A bit. Maybe I'll respawn over there and see what they've done with it. Let's take a look and see what's going on there. Somebody else here? They haven't bombed through this one yet. Ah, it's this fucking guy. Damn. These guys were playing mad aggressive out there. Silenced AK at a decay base? Wait, a what? No way that guy did not spawn in here and then just run out. What? Let's see how far these fire arrows will get. These TCs. Let's get down to 34, which isn't terrible. Grab the GLs, finish it up. Just to see what's in there and take that tier 3. Call it a day. I would say that was perhaps worth it. Eh. Alright, change of plan, guys. We're going to go ahead and just go absolutely balls to the wall on this guy. We're going to take these GLs and we're going to try to GL his door down. Sound good? Let's do it. Ill-advised for you to run around low health with no heals. Okay, just so anybody, anyone who's curious. Well, that's it. All right, so that's all she wrote. Let's go ahead and just get the rest of this thing metaled up, and then we'll call it a day. And we're back. Sorry if I sound a little scuffed today. It's because I'm feeling like absolute garbage, but that's okay. We still got loot. We haven't been raided, even though we posted up right next to uh, the base that we eco raided. Um, so that's good. Let's go outside and see what's going on. All right. Looks like somebody else may have poked around here. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think somebody may have gotten to this the rest of the way. Yep. Yeah, somebody definitely looted this all the rest of the way out. That's okay. Let's see what's going on here. 
This is a new base that went up right where the old one was. Interesting. Yeah, this guy, uh, this guy definitely got the loot out of there. We don't really have enough boom to do anything to him right now. But we could possibly make some. We don't have bean cans. We don't have any boom. This guy laddered up on here too. Alright, so... Let's do a little bit of roaming and see what we can find. Kinda need to do some farming also. Well, if I lose the 4x, that's not the worst. It's not great, but it won't kill us. All the scientists are still on. Ooh. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? Ah, I see. So I think what that guy did was he probably, um, probably raided one of these bases and then chucked that little shop front there. The way he built it though, it can't be accessed by drones, which is kind of an L. Damn, there's a lot of building going on. That one fully decayed. I'm not being very cautious out here. Let's see if anything's left. That's going to be a pretty big base when it's done. Looks like they're setting it up for a big compound. It's going. It's got to go real soon. Like, I can't imagine. 22 health. Yeah, this thing is not long for this world. Let's see if we can reevaluate our boom situation now that we've got this uh, bean can. Maybe we can research it right away. Come here. There we go. Uh, let's move this down to the back. Honestly, should probably move a lot of this stuff back, but I'm not that worried about losing it, honestly, since it was so free. I need to get this organized. This base is a mess. Some Okay. Uh, let's see if we can use what left what scrap we have left to just blast through some BPs. Let's see if we can get cl even close to the satchel BP. Let's try to go finish up some research here. Maybe we'll get lucky and our Chad neighbor is going to be uh, doing cargo. Yep. Well, okay. Son, okay, yeah, that's a lot of wood. Okay, we depot, come back. I also want that mixing table, bro. That's the other thing. Now that I'm thinking about it, I want to get these before they break. Oh. We get rid of one of these. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Well, good thing we got the uh, stuff that we needed. The reason I'm stacking these window frames is because they take 30 seconds to craft, just like tool cupboards do. Um, but if you accidentally craft one of them, it only uses 50 wood instead of 1,000. So it's a much smaller loss than just accidentally letting a bunch of tool cupboards get crafted, which I definitely usually do. Um, it does take a lot longer to kind of consume the wood that you've got in your inventory, but... It's not a bad system if you're forgetful like me. Uh, 
Okay. And as long as you go in here and right click on whichever um, item's coming up next in the queue, it'll automatically bump that forward and reset the timer. So you see that timer's there. Keep clicking it. It re basically rotates those items and prevents you from building them. At least I don't have to farm any wood. That's really nice. Um, that's pretty much it, honestly. I don't really think there's anything worth hanging around here for at this point. I'm going to go over to that other island and see what they got. Alright, we're gonna go explore this, see if there's anything worth going for. Alright, let's find out what the goop is. It's a goop situation. Decent. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Just get everything boxed up to prevent it from despawning. Oh, that's a lot of turrets. I think we're officially set. Yeah. Uh, we need to get some of this goop out of here. That is close. They must be raiding that thing across the water. They are. Damn. Alright. Those boys didn't stand a chance. Good lord almighty, brother. Uh, there's no mats. Uh, enough wood to get a couple of code lock or a couple of key locks down. That's a lot of C4. Or they wanted something more sexual. I started blasting. All right. Do not know what he had, but it ah, he had a Thompson. The thing is, he could easily have more bags. Alright, let me try to lock all the ammo down. That way there's no loose ammo in here. Okay, that should be all of those cleared.
Oh, I forgot about this box. I don't want them to come looking around here. They see this, I want this I want as many of these boxes to be gone as possible. see so good, so I missed. Then they ran away. I ran after them. Okay. Bang! Tried to shoot them in the back, but I don't want so good either. That worked out pretty well. This guy definitely knew that I was in here. Can't leave the broken jackies here. Take the fixed ones. This guy's gotta be on a bag timer soon, like there's no way. <laughs> GG bro, GG. Hey, don't you own that base over there? Uh, just the one like on the same island, like right over yonder, that big one with the armored shooting floor. This thing got looted. So you're telling me you don't live in this big tower right over here? Uh, so I I have control of it. Ah. You know what I'm saying? Here, come here real quick. Yeah, yeah. So, if you stand up here, do you see that base over there, where those dudes are? Yeah, yeah. Didn't they that's, just raid that's that? That's my main. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just raided me. Damn. Uh, that popped up, like, overnight. I didn't see that yesterday at all. Yeah, yeah, like, so I raided all three of these bases. It took, like, most of the good stuff out. Ah. Wait, were you with those heli guys last night? There was, like, a scrap heli that came through here. This was this was one of them. Well, I took mostly I mostly took everything out to uh, put in my main base. And oh damn! This morning or like just a second ago, because I've seen that you've been over here for a while. And, uh, uh, my teammates loading on right now. Uh, I'll have them invite you to team. Hell yeah! And, like we can just sit here and do stuff all the way. So I have all these bases. Uh, he should be on in a second. This was the one that I had my eyes set on yesterday. Oh, yeah. It had one floor tile that was decaying, and I just couldn't get to it. Yeah, and so I got, I got through it. Morning. Yeah, it's the same base. Oh, yeah. Nice. It's pretty Dude. sick. This, uh, this top box right here was full of uh, sulfur. Shit. 
Yeah, I have like a little metal base. Uh, it's like a two by one across the water there. You can almost just see it. It's like just out of render distance, right by that swamp. Up on the, the cliff? Uh, yeah, if you look straight, like 320, it's like pretty much straight that way. There's like a like honeycombed one by two up there. Yeah, we were gonna raid it like last night. Yeah, the dude who put up right next to me, he's got all armored roofs, so he's probably juiced too. I'll show you where I'm at. It's probably the one you were thinking of. Yeah, I think they might be chain raiding. It sounds like they're down this way. Oh, they might be in the cave. That could be. Yeah, yeah I, told, I told them that I lived in the cave, but I don't. So, ah. if they're in the cave, I'm gonna I'm a camp like up here. Hell yeah. There's a... Uh... You wanna go grab a gun? Yeah, yeah. I'll be back. Yeah, I'll grab an extra. Flashlight for you. some stuff over here. Let's see if maybe they hit this. Well, like my base is probably next on the list. Well, might call it there for the day. We'll see what happens. Chances are good we get raided. And there's all this stuff, but I'm feeling like trash, so I'm probably gonna call it anyway. Maybe I'll hop back on and get this dude some of that loot too. We'll see what happens.